Welcome to Blossom. My name is Funke Famoroti and I welcome you to this episode of Blossom. And today I just want to charge you up to stop it. Yes, stop self pity. I know you are down, you are out there and you are feeling bad of what you are going through right now. And you are you're wondering how you are going to come out of this. You are feeling pity for yourself. Yes, it's okay to feel pity for oneself just for a while. But when it begins to linger on, it's not healthy. For the advancement of an individual. Often at times when we go through stuff, sometimes people are there for us to, you know, empathize with us and you know, help us through that situation. But after a while, you discover that people begin to leave. And when people begin to leave, you begin to feel pity for yourself. Say, oh, um, why am I going through what I'm going through and stuff like that. But I want to encourage you to stop pity party today. Stop pitying yourself because you see, oftentimes when we don't stop pitying ourselves, we don't get past that maze we are going through. Years back, I, I was, I finished from school and I was jobless and I didn't, I didn't have any money. I didn't know what I was going to do, and I've actually left home because I, I decided to start life on my own. And I told my parents to just stay clear that I'll find a means of making it on my own. So I didn't have any money. And I didn't know what to do. I was always like, oh, what am I going through all this? I was, I was just pitying myself. Until one day, I just said to myself, stop pitying yourself. And until I got to that point, I never saw a solution beyond the, the, the predicament I was that time. I just want to encourage you, whatever it is you are going through right now, stop pitying yourself. Stop pitying yourself. Because when you stop pitying yourself, you discover that you're, you begin to see a clearer horizon of the solutions ahead for you. Every problem has an expiring date. It has a beginning and it has an ending. So when you have this understanding, you will just shake up yourself that you know what. And guess what? You determine when your problem will end. You determine the end of that particular hapless situation you are going through. So until you get to that level of having this determination, you can't get past that situation. So I want to encourage you to stop pitying yourself. When you stop it, you will begin to see clearer things. I know God has glorious things set ahead for you in the future and in, in, in this particular year. I believe he will do what he has to do, but it's left for you to do your own part. Till I come your way next time, stay blessed and stay calm.